Okay. Okay. Yeah, I was sucking on <laughs> I'm minding a lot. This is some crazy work right here, bro. I'm minding a lot. Just reading it. Just reading this right here. I don't even know why I'm reacting to this. What's up, Two of Fish Gang? Y'all know Two of Fish EJ here. Back on another reaction. And today we're going to be reacting to ex church leader gets caught for 16 year old. Now that's crazy work. I'm not a lot, boy. You're disgusting. Yeah. <laughs> Let's get to the video, bro. I ain't going to hold y'all here too long. Let's do it. Share everything. Jeez. All right. Let's do it. On the night of July 14th, 2022, officers in Palm Coast, Florida were investigating a noise complaint when they stumbled upon an ex-church leader and pastor Alfonso Joseph, who was 48 years old at the time, and in the back seat of a car with a 16-year-old boy. When officers shined their flashlight at- Wait, what? A 16-year-old boy? But you too freaky, but what the hell? Why are you in the back seat with a boy? You 48. Hmm. In the car, both occupants were seen pulling their pants up. Here's what happened next. Oh, nah. I might be able to make this video. Hell no, nah, bro. Ain't no way in hell. I just heard that shit. I gotta be dreaming. A 48 year old man, a 16 year old boy, they both in the back seat. Pulling their drawers and their pants up. Let that sink in. <laughs> but you too freaky, but hell no, nah, but hell. How's it going, sir? Hey, how are hey, you? Sir. Just stepping out of here for me? Shut the door for me? But what the hell? How's it going, man? You have any weapons on you or anything like that? No, 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 sir. Yeah. You got ID on you? Yes. But, oh, you, ID on you? No. Freaky, you don't have any ID on you? Yeah. Yes. Uh, like what? What is Buddy doing right? <laughs> Why Buddy tooting and shit up? <laughs> hey, idea. He was trying to make his shit look no. bad. You don't have it. <laughs> Buddy did it on purpose, but he wants somebody to get in his shit. <laughs> but uh, too freaky. Any idea on you? No, no, I didn't. It's all right, sir. I'll get your name. You step over here. Go to my car right there. Okay. Okay. Step over there. Just stand right there. Lean on the car for me. Put your hands on the car. Now I'm just gonna pat you down for weapons. Okay. If you're not doing body weight strength, you're nuts. I fixed hey. five bulging discs, uh, spinal stenosis, arthritis. Here, right here. Hand on the car. Hand on the car for me. You have anything on you? No. Well, I have my phone on. That's fine. Leave it there. Are we being detained? Yes, that's right now. Here, I'm probably probably. Oh, you can put your hands on the car. Don't, don't lean on the car. Just put your hands on the car. Put your feet. Do you have anything on you? No. no my phone. Just my... your phone. No weapons in there. What's that? Headphones? Yeah. I'm just going to put them back in there. So do we just have to leave? Or? Okay, right now I'm going to get your information first. And then, uh, what is going on? Okay. All right, you go ahead and lean around the car for me. Turn around. Just lean on the car right there. What's your name? Alfonso. Alfonso. A L F O N Z. How you say it? What's your name? Alfonso. Alfonso. Ah, uh, yeah, bro. Nope. You want it, though? You want it, though? That's all I need to know, bro. But, uh, uh two, you got a little sugar in your tank, bro. Ain't nothing wrong with that. But, yeah, you, you, you want to do it to him for a fact. You most definitely want to do it. Mocha, you want to chill out? I'm sorry, y'all. That, that's my cat, Mocha. She doing too much. Let's see, let me get back to this. A-L-F-O-N-Z-O. Yeah. Last name? Joseph. Hey, what's your date of birth? 11673. All right, just stand right there for a second. What are you guys doing? Obviously, it's kind of obvious. Who's with you? Huh? Who's with you? Um, just the plan, So, uh, who's this guy? Um, a friend of mine. Okay, how old is he? Um, 18. Okay. Do you have a driver's license, though? No. A friend of yours. He's 18. Really, he's 16. But the fact that Nessie ain't know that you in the back seat with another boy, hands down. What, like... It ain't no escaping that, bro. 
But you just too freaky. Like, what what did you teach him, bro? You trying to teach him how to or the clap song? Like, nah, nigga, we we ain't stupid, nigga. You trying to crack? You trying to crack? Simple as that, nigga. Do I have any kind of identification? No. Where does he live? Um, in the second. Okay. So, what's his name? What's his last name? Um, I don't know his last name. I always call him. Okay, so what are you guys doing out here? Uh, we was just chilling, that's all. Just chilling? It was getting just hot in the car, so I was doing the drill. Well, when I walked up, you were putting your shorts on. No, my shorts, because a lot of times, when my shorts, they get kind of stuck. Mm -hmm. So I was, like, trying to fix them. Okay. Because when you see in the car, you get... But this nigga don't even have on no shoes. Bro, you, you you basically telling me that you cracked this boy without saying you cracked this boy. That's what it's giving. You crack buddy without telling me you crack buddy. And now you trying to make an excuse about your shorts, y'all. Hear what he's saying about his his shorts. Stuck. Mm -hmm. So I was like trying to fix them. Okay. Cause when you see in the car, you get stuck. Because a lot of times. When my shorts didn't get kind of stuck, mm -hmm. so I was like trying to fix them. Okay. Because when you see in the car, you get it get wet. It's sometimes give you a wedge. Okay. So Luis. Nah, nigga. Nah, nigga. You trying to fix his wedge, bro? You were digging in his jump, bro, for gold, bro. Like, come on, bro. You too freaky, bro. Like, you know what you doing, bro? I don't even want to hear. I don't even want to hear, but you want to know. It, it, I'm sorry. And it's it's like you trying to run away from it. But it would've been cool if you just come out clean, just be like, all right. Did what happened type shit. But you just trying to make excuses. So, but I don't even want to hit. See how it looks? I come up, you two are in the back seat. Right. Because the front seat, um, we, the front seat is like far away from me. Mm -hmm. So I was like, you know, just talking, communicating, trying to get to know him. And, um, and that was it. But, I, but you see how it looks I, to me? I got you. You guys are in the back. I got you. I got you. Doing something. Because yeah. as soon as we turned our lights on, you started moving around real fast. Yeah, because, you know, it's a secluded, secluded place. Mm -hmm. And we wouldn't expect them, yeah. you know, and I understand. And there's not supposed to be anybody back here. Oh, no? No, there's a no trespassing sign over by the, oh, I didn't the entrance over there. Wow. How long have you been up here? How long have I been out here? Mm -hmm. Maybe 15 minutes. Okay. And I was just getting ready to drop them off home. Okay. No, no one's going to join. I just told you it was just to be entertained because you're on private property, okay? It's a no trespassing sign around the front. Okay. All right, you guys are in no trespassing area, okay? It's not free to go. So we figure out what's going on, okay? Where yeah. were you guys coming from? Oh, we just come from this house. Oh, okay. Uh, no, I'd rather you stay out of the car for right now. Just try and smack them off. So who is he to you? What is his friend? Where did you meet him? Um, I met him um, a couple days ago, and then we wanted to meet up just to get to know him, and that was it. Okay. Yeah. Okay. It's been crazy, you know. Nothing crazy? So you met him online, you said? No, well, not online. I met him, like, we was in Walmart one day, and then... So after, you guys just uh, met up in Walmart? How'd you guys just, like, face face? When I met him online, um, in Walmart, then he um, texted me online. So how did he get your number? Who? Oh. He said he texted you. You guys met in Walmart, and then he started texting you a lot. Yes, online. Okay, so had, so you guys were just both shopping at Walmart, and yeah. then you guys yeah. started talking in Walmart when you guys saw each other. Right. Okay. I asked him a few questions. He was like, "He loved go this place," and he was like, "Tell me where he came from," and I was know where I came from, okay. and then that was it. You guys exchanged phone numbers at that point, and yeah. Okay. And so, what'd you do? Pick him up from his house? Yeah. Or? I picked him up from his house. Because I worked late, so I said, well, um, maybe just come and talk over here. Okay. You know? Okay. And I didn't know it was a, a no trespassing yeah. sign. I knew it was a, it used to be a golf course. Yeah. And I, I didn't know it was a no trespassing sign, because other than that, I wouldn't have been over here. Yeah. Okay. How old are you? Um, I'll be 40, 48. Okay. What were you guys doing? Huh? What were you guys doing? We were just sitting back the seat talking. And I told like I told the cop, I said, um, I took my shirt off because it was getting hot in the car. And then he says, I was trying to fix something. I said, yeah. But just come out clean, but God, yeah, but you, you, you throwing me off right now, boy. You throwing me off, man. Literally. Like, buddy. But I need a full screen with this. But I'm gonna look at you eye to eye when I tell you this, boy. But Nobody cares. Just come out clean, Tony. You were trying to crack on Tony. You were trying to crack on the money. 
That's it. Nobody cares. Nobody give a fuck. You doing all that other shit and nobody give a fuck, nigga. You were trying to crack a 16 year old. Simple. All that other rah, 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 rah shit. Man, man, leave that shit for the birds, bro. Leave that for the birds. Nobody want to hit it. Me, you in the back seat, trying to fix your shorts, cause buddy was topping you off, and you were cracking buddy in the back seat. Tell me, all, I got a wig, man. Shut over that, bro. Like, man, you disgust me, like, bro. I, I gotta get up, man. Like, man. Like, what happened to all the generation of real niggas, man? Like, what happened to the generation of real niggas? I'm to the generation of real niggas, Mocha. I don't even know. I don't even know. I say ask myself, why to the generation of real niggas? Because I don't even know my name. So, because, man, I ain't no fucking way, man. Ain't no way. Because niggas lying about being in the backseat, not only with a minor, but with a boy. At least a female. A boy. Mm -hmm. Crazy work, but it's crazy work. At least you be doing a female, but it says nigga doing a nigga. Nigga, man. I was speaking to myself because a lot of times when you sweat, your shorts get. Your car's on, isn't it? Yeah, but the AC is, you know. It's pretty neutral, you're the. You know, yeah, yeah, it's pretty new. Like, you can tell Buddy had been practicing. He was goddamn going over his lines, bro, before the officer even came or the touch. He's like, I, I know I'm going to get caught up with this 16-year-old, so let me fuck around and do all these lines. I'm going to fuck around and write all this shit, and I'm going to study it just in case the officer come and try to pull up on me, bro. Like, nigga, shut up with all that damn shit. Like, shut up, bro. You fat in here, nigga. Nobody believing a damn word you saying, boy. <laughs> like, real shit, boy. But sometimes it gets hot, so. Yeah, well, you guys have your pants down. I didn't have a lot. I, mean, I, I kind of figure what's going on. I didn't have my pants down though. No, oh, he did. He had his pants down? Yeah. Oh, wow. Okay. So, you know, I guess. Nigga, talking about some old damn wild. Nigga, ain't no damn old damn wild. Nigga, you know what the fuck going on, bro. You know exactly what the fuck going on. 2022. Yeah. You cracking, buddy. Tell me what's going on now. That, that, that if it is, if it, if that's what you guys are doing, that's what you guys are going to do. Right. At some point. Right. It is what it is. Right. You know, people do it all the time, say? but you don't need to lie. Okay. Okay. Yeah, I was sucking. Okay. All right. We'll see what. I'm done. I'm fucking done. I'm fucking done, dude. I'm fucking done. What the fuck? What the fuck? He just came out clean and just like, how can you just come out clean and just say that, bro? Okay. Okay. Yeah, I was sucking him. <laughs> like, yeah, I was sucking him. He's just like, yeah, I'm sucking him. You see that monkey? You see this? You see this shit? Come here. You see this? Yeah, I was sucking him off. Like, this nigga just look. He just looking at this shit like it's nothing, bro. Like it's nothing. Bro, man. Hold on, bro. I, I want the whole pack to see a full screen of this. Yeah, I was sucking them all. He would do it all the time, but you don't need to lie. Okay, okay. Yeah, I was sucking them <laughs> Yeah, I was sucking them all. <laughs> okay. Okay, buddy. <laughs> Whatever you say, freak ass nigga. <laughs> Whatever you say, nigga. <laughs> hey. <laughs> Hold on, nigga. <laughs> Hold on, bro. One hand, two hand, nigga. Good. Uh, uh. <laughs> or no hand, nigga. Just use. 
I nigga, I bro, whatever you say. Bro. Like I said, it's niggas, man. Niggas, man. Niggas. Okay. All right. Was he with anybody at Walmart when you met him, or was he by himself? I just by himself. He wasn't okay. no one. Does he drive or anything like that? Not, not that I know of. Nobody knew that health care could be so complicated. Trump was a failure on health care. Hundreds of thousands of black Americans lost health care insurance. We cannot go back. Biden and Harris have expanded coverage for black families. Joe Biden is getting the job done. Did you just buy a one wheel? Well, we have been looking to get outside more. Plus, it's kind of like snowboarding. There's sensors to... Go ahead and turn around, camp around back. Got some big wrists. Anything on your nose? Yeah. Over here, the right side of my car. What's in here that's here? Right Have a seat in there. <sighs> now, is there anything in the car we need to worry about? I know. Okay. Sit tight. Statement for us, what tonight? Um, do I have to go to like a police station to do that? No, no, you do that right here. Right here? Yeah. Am I being detained? At this time, yes. Right. Like I'm going to jail? No, no. You're not under arrest. Jail you're being or detained. detained. Are two different things. Okay, am I going to jail? You're just being detained. You're not under arrest. You're, you're, you're not, not free, free to leave. You're not free to go right now. And we are going to have to have you get a hold of your grandparents to come pick you up. Okay. I'll get you a statement. You're good, I got it. Stanford, you're good. All right, are you willing to talk to us? Yes. Okay, so go over what occurred tonight. Uh, we just came and chilled okay. over here. Where'd you pick him up? Uh, from home. And do you know where his house is? Yeah. When did you, where'd you meet him again? At home. No, where'd you meet him? Like, oh, like where'd you guys first meet? Walmart. Walmart. Okay, how, how long ago was that? Maybe, I don't know, two weeks ago. Two weeks ago? And then you just met and what? And then I um, texted him. Well, okay. he texted me. And he wanted to talk, so we came over here to talk. Okay, you guys just been exchanging from phone exactly. numbers when yeah. you guys were at Walmart, and then just started talking for the past couple weeks. Right. Okay. And you said he advised you to come pick him up tonight. Yeah. Okay. And after you picked him up, well, you came over here, straight over here. Right. Okay. What were you guys gonna do after that? After you were doing what you were doing? That was it. Yeah. You know, so all you were gonna do, and what were you gonna do after that? I was gonna drop him back at home. Drop him off back at home. Yeah. Okay. Is this the first time you ever had like interaction with him other than in Walmart? And besides, uh, yeah, that? it's the first time. Yeah. Okay. All right. All right, so obviously we got two different stories. You said you met him today, first time. First time you ever met him. You never met him anywhere else. Like I said, you're not in trouble. We're just trying to clarify the end of the story. So you didn't meet him at a Walmart a couple weeks ago? You didn't meet him at a Walmart a couple weeks ago? You're saying you just met tonight. He's saying you met two weeks ago at Walmart and exchanged information. And you guys been talking since. That's not what happened, so you first met him today on Tinder? Yeah. Okay, all right. Did you know how old he was, by any chance? Yeah. Okay. Mr. Joseph was charged with lewd or lascivious battery. He pleaded guilty to the charges and was sentenced to five years in prison with 10 years of sex offender probation after his sentence. Don't forget to leave a like, comment, and subscribe. I'm glad y'all ain't even have to see all that, bro. Like, I didn't even know I was covering the whole screen. I didn't even know. But just to go over everything, what was shown, matter of fact, I'm just gonna keep it like this. Just to go over everything that was shown. Basically, the 16 year old was talking about, like, it wasn't their first time meeting. Forty-seven year old nigga from around time out like that yada yada y'all. You won't gonna do nothing else, which we know that's cal cause why both of y'all short so Yeah. And you just pleaded some out on sucking video like <sighs> boy. I said <laughs> I don't, I don't know anymore, bro. I don't know anymore. I don't know no more, more so to, it's like, because niggas dead ass out here doing this shit for real, bro, and they think this shit cool. They think this shit cool. That shit ain't cool, bro. 
Let alone you 47 years old. He's 16. This nigga is not even. He's still a minor, bro. This nigga is still a minor. And you fucking around and doing all those things, bro. You nasty, bro. Bro, you deserve more than five years. They being nice, bro. Ten years probation, they ain't need enough five. You need life of probation. You violate that bitch, you go down for good. I bet you if he was a female, but he would've got way more years. But he still deserves it regardless, man. But anyways, bro. I'm not gonna hold y'all here too long, bro. Y'all seen what I just seen. Two of you season, bro. And I'm out, bro. Peace.